one of those. Secret about the vending machine in the front of the station. Okay. Anonymous 10. When are they going to fix that vending machine lol? Wait, what's this secret? You can actually still buy drinks at our mark that's sold out. What? The machine's broken, so there's drinks marked sold out when it's not. Just press the button. I recommend biotic pack. It looks like the drinks are marked as sold out can be still bought. Oh my god, there's a hack? That actually helps. Well, we can get unlimited free drinks now. What an excellent use of my time there. Alright, it's time. Let's get going. Sweet. Shouldn't we talk about this some more? I still think this is a bad idea. How are you scared of ghosts, but totally fine with this? Cause stuff you can't see is way creepier. Actually, I'm more worried about the things I can't see. Like bats. And knives. Not That's wrong. Big deal, so it's a little dangerous. Come on, let's strike while the iron's hot. Hey, that's Icus's like design. Strike? <laughs> yep, strike on. <laughs> You're actually excited about this? I love danger. Oh my god, we're going together? This is so cute! Yay! Gonna take him on. What? Damn it. I thought you could. Wait, where are they going now? Yeah, you can walk on them to the instead of teleporting this guy. Alright, senpais, we're going out. Yeah, I don't know what you're up to, but just avoid going anywhere dangerous. No, we're not. Oops. Are you all three of you heading out together? Take care not to get injured. Well, thanks for not being so concerned. Alright, fine, with this head out. Hold on, you're not actually going to Port Island Station, right, Arnie? Now, have you heard of the reports? It's super insane. Well, she has more sense. If you stop complaining already, it'll be nothing. All we have to do is take the monorail to the station. What's so hard about that? That's not exactly what I meant by not easy. You know, Yucatan, you might actually be scarier than a punks were bound to run into. Damn, okay. There's so many people here. Check out those rags. They're from Gecko High. Why do we have a uniform on? Oh man, this is even worse than I thought. Hmm. You must have taken a wrong turn. Cause this place ain't for you, buddy. Uh, well, I... Just ignore them. Being here is ruining our vibe. Beat it, goatee. Damn. Goatee? Oh, <laughs> you mean me. We don't need your permission to be here. Tell them, Yukari. Hey, are you nuts? Read the room, won't you? I can read just fine. <laughs> Come on, don't be intimidated by these punks. You're a boss. What did you just say? She said you're punks. She just called us punks. Come on, let's post some pictures that'll make her daddy cry. Hope you've been practicing your sexy poses. Shouldn't say that word. <laughs> Good. These guys are scum. Damn. Oh, so now we're scum, huh? What? Man, I feel sorry for you, goatee. This bitch is a real pain in the ass, isn't she? Ow. Suck a punch. Yeah, I said it. Jinpei! <laughs> That's enough. Why are you beating him up over here? Coward. I didn't know what they were getting into. I'll make sure they leave. You Whoa. good with that? Who do you think you are, dumbass? The bestest boy ever. You want some too? Oh, he still does it. <laughs> Son of a bitch! You just crossed the line. You think you're going home alive now? Should we find out? Damn, cold. Uh, no, maybe not. Good idea. Don't punch a random guy. Oh, man. What a loser. Bastard. Your name's Aragaki, right? Yeah. Now I remember. Shinjiro Aragaki. You're from Gecko High, too, aren't you? Damn it, you're gonna regret this. Bye. 
People still hanging around me. Oh, man, senpai. That was awesome. You are awesome. You guys were in Aki's room at the hospital. Oh, you said Aki. You idiots. <laughs> hey, big fan. You don't belong here. Wait. Sorry, but I love his portrait. No, before we leave. Did Aki tell you to come here? Sort of. That dumbass. <laughs> well, what do you want to know? Is this about that ghost story? You know? Yes, that's right. How'd you know? The rumor's been going around. Yeah, this but that's in school. The hospital, we're here talking shit every night. Uh. Brag about all the stuff they did to some girl named Yamagishi. Fuka. Yamagishi. Fuka. You mean Fuka Yamagishi from 2E? They were picking on her. Uh. That's why people are saying it's Yamagishi's ghost that did it. Uh. Yamagishi-san's ghost? Wait, what do you mean by that? You guys don't know? Mm. This Yamagishi girl might be dead. Oof. I heard she hasn't been home in over a week. Wait, what? I thought she was just out recovering. So, you mean she's still missing? Mm. So much for that ghost story. Mr. Akota is the homeroom teacher for 2E, right? Does he know about this? I get it, Aki. So trying to make up for the past. Hmm. It's you who can't let go. Huh? What's that got to do with anything? Nothing. Anyways, that's all I know. We done here? Um. Yeah, totally. Thanks a lot. Oh, cheating play. Come on. Show some appreciation. Yeah. You really saved us. Just don't come around here again. Thank you. Thank you for helping us. And for sharing what you know. That was really nice of you. I'm drenched in cold sweat. But man, that aragaki son told us what's shocking her. I'll let Kurichi Senpai know what we found out about Yamagishi san. The fact that she's still missing is no small matter. Man, we're totally gonna get yelled at doing that without permission. I can already see it happening. Don't matter. We could just say it's Ikari's idea anyway. Seriously, go to places like that. There are limits to how reckless he could be, says you, Aki. I mean, I'm proud of you guys for trying to get the information, but be a little more careful next time. Hmm. Yamagishi has disappeared. It began with a ghost story, but it has developed into a serious situation. We have to do something. Well, she's not telling us all. Hey. That guy looked kind of scary, but he was actually really nice, don't you think? Yeah, I agree. Yeah. Well, you can't judge a book by its cover and all that. But what was he doing at a, that place? Hmm. I told you it was a good idea to go there, dude. If Aragaki san didn't help us, who knows what would have happened to us? Uh, I'm getting an ulcer just thinking about it. Oof. I said I was sorry. I didn't think it would be that bad. But now you know. Next time I have a little more faith in what I say. Anyways, there's no way in hell I'm ever setting foot in that place again. Yeah, sorry about that. Uh, maybe... Hmm, if something I want to go today there. If he's not there, I'm going to be so upset. Mm -hmm. Oh, they're all here! Oh, Yuki-kun, we're just talking about you. Let me introduce you to Ken. Nice to meet you, my name is Ken Amada. So cute. I attend Gekkon Elementary School. A very polite. Really? I think it's pretty normal to greet someone like that. New like that. Elementary ki school kids seem more grown up, huh? Amada kun drops by the shrine pretty often. That's close to our dorm, you know. So if you ever see him, say hello, okay, Yuki? Yeah. Cute. No. Why did she say he was here and he never comes here? Ikari and Chupei-san often help me out. Especially Ikari-san, her advice is very useful. I don't say anything that special though. And my Dakun is surprisingly reliable. And he's so much more mature than stupid. <laughs> hey, oh you can come to me for advice too, you know? All your problems and concerns will be solved 100% satisfaction guaranteed. Um, okay, I'll think about it. Oh, it's baby time. 
The samurai movie was quite thrilling, but the lead role plays ruffians in the film. He looked just like my scary uncle. I did not want to think about him. Aw, oh, don't worry about him. So dishonest. You are right. This fight is far from over. Maybe he seems to chill out. Good. Shall we get some food to help improve our moods? Come now, let us go, Makoto Dono. I do not fear my ankle. Good. Oh, it's you. Yuki, could you free up your day tomorrow for me? What? There's a lot to be done for Fuku Yamagishi's case, so I'm going to require your assistance. Please. If you have any urgent affairs, then I suggest you settle them by the end of today. Here we go. Oh. So, you're supposed to gather in front of the facility office during lunch. Okay. To be honest, I don't feel like doing it, but we don't have a choice. And asking Mr. Ikoda for an explanation sounds like a total pain in the ass. This is so lame, especially compared to when we went to that spot behind the station at night. Oh damn. Kirijo Senpai, why are you here? Yeah. Same reason you are. Mr. Ikoda, I'm here to ask you about a student named Fuka Yamagishi. No! Please, I... I never thought it'd turn out this way. Fuka... Hey, I remember you. What did you do to Yamagishi? Hold on, Kiri Jokun. This isn't an interrogation. Stop scaring her. She's all scaring her. You don't have to say anything if you don't want to. You wouldn't want to give her the wrong idea. Fuka, she she always looked so frazzled whenever I gave her a hard time. That's when I realized she may be a model student, but Deep down, she's just like us. And because of that, I knew exactly which buttons to push. Yeah, the wrong ones. Earlier that day, too. It was May 29th. We took Fuka to the gym and locked the door from the outside. That's fucked up. What? You trapped her inside? <laughs> That's what I said. That's messed up. That night, Maki got worried Fuka might commit suicide, so uh. she went back to the school by herself. Ooh. But she never came back. And the next morning, it was, she was that bad. Outside the front gate. Ooh. I went to the gym to let Fuka out, but the door was still locked. So I opened it and went inside, but she wasn't there. We all freaked out. Starting that night, we went out looking for her. But uh. every night. Another one of us wouldn't come back. And then they all ended up like Maki. I see. Thanks, Mr. Akoda, all this time you've been reporting Yamagishi is absent due yeah. to illness. But the truth of the matter is that she was missing. You had to have known this. Yeah. You little Explain shit. Explain yourself. I was thinking of the students, of course. You were. Children may not understand, but we have to consider the future of everyone affected. So you chose not to report a missing child mm. for the good of the class, and not because you didn't want the police involved. Ooh, get him. It, it was in her best interest. I wouldn't want her records to be stained by something like this. Her parents agreed. Um. So to protect your career, you ignored your responsibility as a teacher. Mm. Despicable. Very. Despi- No, I-, I I didn't mean, uh, I, I was just... That's enough. You can go now, we'll handle the rest. Mm. Wait, but... Don't worry. This won't be the last of mm. this. Get his ass. You suck! We will remember this. About your friends. Did you notice anything unusual about them before they went missing? Anything at all? <sighs> A voice. A creepy voice. They all mentioned it right before they went missing. They said they could hear it, calling their name. Oh, man. Senpai, could it be? It's them. No doubt about it. Up until now, we've never been able to predict who exactly would become aware during the dark hour. This voice must be the key. In That's other so words, it eerie. happen randomly. 
They actually get drawn in. Like a siren. Now, after seeing all of this, they're clearly targeting. Yeah, this is the only time it happens. Stay at our dorm tonight. That should be the safest place. If you hear the voice, tell us immediately. And don't leave your room no matter what happens. If you can manage that, you should be fine. Don't worry. Yamagishi should be all right as well. Yeah. Luka. Yuki. Yori and Takeba too. We'll meet after school in the student council room to discuss tonight's operation. Tonight? Yes. We are going to rescue Fuka Yamagishi. Ooh. Good. You're all here. Tonight, we're infiltrating the campus. Our objective is to rescue Fuka Yamagishi. Uh, I don't get it. Are you saying Yamagishi is inside the school somewhere? Mm. And why are we doing this at night? At midnight, this place turns into... Exactly. Yeah. That's how Yamagishi wandered into Tartarus. Somewhere she's up there. Wait. You mean Yamagishi-san's been over there ever since she got locked in the gym? That's right. But that was ten days ago! No matter how you look at it, she's gotta be... Don't lose hope just yet. Mm. Tartarus only appears during the dark hour. So where does it go for the rest of the day? Um, it don't exist. That's a good point. This is just a theory. But I think time flows differently in Tartarus. So even though it's been 10 days for us, it could have only been 10 hours. That's what I say, Clever. There's a chance she's still alive. Wow, you think so? But wait, isn't the dark hour pretty brutal though? Even for us. How could she last 10 days worth in there? That is true. And even if she is still alive, we might not be able to get to her. Are you just gonna abandon her then? No. Right Relax, the Aki. The same way Yamagishi did. We'll go to the gym and wait for midnight. That'll be the quickest way. Mm. Is that really gonna work? In all honesty, I can't say I fully agree with this. If something goes wrong, you could all end up lost in Tartarus too. But... I'm not just gonna stand here and do nothing. If there's a chance we can save her, I'd never forgive myself. Aww. If you guys aren't with me, then I'm going in on my own. Damn. Uh, senpai? Alright. You should be worried about good. everyone else's we'll safety, not just, just your own. Right. And we won't know until we try. Oof. Guess we're sneaking into the school then. <laughs> In that case, I've got just the thing. You do? That man does. No answer. Are you calling him? Ikutsuki? This is a problem. I can't get a hold of the chairman. Uh. Well, that's not a big deal, right? He's pretty useless, so. Oh, uh, you know, I forgot the sure vegetables. The school. No need to worry. I've got it all set. All set? An explosive? What? All right, I'll let you handle this. I don't think it's that. There's no time to waste. Let's go. Imagine that. Just a C4 planet on the door. An actual explosive? Uh, no. Uh, all I did was unlock a door. See? We got in no problem. Mm. Man, I'm a genius. Good job, Chupay. Is there really something to brag about here? Hmm? So you unlocked it earlier. Très bien. Mm -hmm. Oui, good job. We should <laughs> the French. Somewhere to get ourselves ready. Your classroom should work, right? I love how he said we. Oui. Trey Ben? Is that French or something? Yeah. Why are they talking You're correct. languages anyway? <laughs> Why not? Aw, you scared? No, I'm not. Stupid. <laughs> Yay, that's uncalled for. Quiet. We need to get started. It's better for us if the lights are off. They cut the power at night anyway. Uh. Oh, we're searching the faculty office, huh? Oh, sorry. Maybe I should go to the faculty office too. It sounds interesting. 
You're not planning to do something unethical under my supervision, are you? No. I suppose you'll need to be executed. Hey, come on! <laughs> Obviously, I was joking. <laughs> I wouldn't blame him, honestly. All I meant by interesting was that there's a higher chance of finding the key there. I'll key? Will well, you pick you up? Let's head to the janitor's room. Damn. Iori, you're coming with us. No. All right, let's get this over with. Poor oh, Junpei. Still this music? <laughs> okay, sorry. Can you? Unbelievable. <laughs> yes, it still does it. <laughs> this is the thing you must do in this situation. <laughs> Nothing happened though. It's still funny. Do you hear something? No. Now I do. What? There's someone else here. We gotta hide. Find the pillar. Dang, we're really trying to hide, aren't we? We're just standing like planks. It was just a security guard. Yes, yeah, Harry. I know. Oh God. <laughs> M my phone. Why now? Aww. That could have hurt that. Of course, it's just spam. Really? Yeah, for ring total spam. People out, right? Come on, the thing just rang out of nowhere. <laughs> that was so cute. I'm gonna die. What? <laughs> oh shit! I'm sorry. Ugh. Why do I keep skipping? And she hates me now. No, no. It's so dark. I can barely read these. Well, put your phone torch on. What does it say on this one? Jim. Yeah, this is it. I'm sure they won't mind if we borrow this. Yoink. Did you find the key? Yeah. Sure did. You know, I heard a scream that sounded kind uh. of... <laughs> huh? Wait, you actually did? I uh. was just You want to take this outside? Guys, come on. All right. We'll divide into teams again. Three of you will enter Tartarus, and one of you will remain outside with me. Once the dark hour begins, I'll pinpoint Yamagishi's position. Oh. I'm going in. You come too. You can take the lead as usual. No doubt. I'll be glad how. Uh, then I'll be the third. Wait a second, Yukatan. Remember how oh. I accidentally screwed up on the monorail? Give me a chance to make up for that. Aww. Of course he can. It's not always about you. Besides, you didn't accidentally screw up. Oof. Give him a brain play. Right, we'll give you another shot. And with that, the teams are set. Again, so you should be asking me to choose the teams, Aki. What's wrong, Takeba? Do you have a problem staying with Mitsuru? Uh, no, no. It's fine. It's almost time. Let's go. It kind of stinks because she's our only healer. I only got Dia. I. That's right. I. Guess I'm alone after all. Aww. Huka. <laughs> that is so freaky. from them. The transmission range is at max, too. Hmm. Uh, I hope that girl Moriyama is okay at the dorm. Yeah. Unfortunately, no place is completely safe in the dark hour. But we couldn't risk bringing her here. And having one of us stay behind to watch her wasn't an option either. Yeah. Yeah, I guess so. Hmm. 
We are all here for Yamagishi-san's sake. There he is. I'm here. I've confirmed your position. You're higher up than I expected. You're barely in communication range. Is mm. everyone all right? I don't know. Got separate. Akihiko, oh damn. Come in, Akihiko. Uh, is he out of range? That's worrying. Mm. No good. I'm on the floor. Wakey wakey Makoto All by myself Are you alright? Yeah I can't get any backup Damn Looks like I'm sorry Find Akiko and the others Looks like I can do my own analysis Oh god Oh, look at you! What's your current location? Reply immediately. I'm this. Are you human? Cute. She can hear Mitsuru. Where am I? Why am I here? Please answer me. She is hella adorable. Must protect. Also, I just realized it's Freak of Friday. At the moment. There you two are. He still has his hat. Oh. Boo. It's not in the cutscene. Man, we were worried about you. I'm glad you are safe. I don't think we should enter Tartarus this way again. Yeah. Oh yeah. Did you hear a voice on your way here? Yeah, kind of like. Who's there? Are you human? No. Oh. That's it. That's the voice. <laughs> Didn't that come from behind us? In front of you. Wait, she was there. What are you hiding there? Oh. Are you Fuka Yamagishi? Yes. Cute. Wow, you're alive. That's awesome. Never fear. <laughs> the heroes are here. Good to see you're okay. Come with us. Thank you so much. I... Um, you're safe now. Oh, yes, I'll be fine. I contact. Sorry, I'm just so relieved. You're so cute. Looks like I made the right call then. I'll see if I can contact Mitsuru. What is this place? One second I was at school, and then... Uh, it's kind of a long story. We can explain after we get out of here. Oh, are you hurt anywhere? You've probably seen the monsters wandering around, right? I've gotten by without them finding me so far. Good. Wait, you've avoided them this entire time? How is that possible? Um, well, they're all predictable, you know. to describe, but I can sort of tell where they are. Aww. The same power as Mitsuru, actually. She might be even stronger. Mitsuru's persona is always more combat focused to begin with. Yeah. Persona? Hang on to this. Damn. Huh? Wait, is this. No, you one. Think of it as a lucky charm. It doesn't actually fire bullets. Ooh. Oh, check out the moon. It's huge. See if it totters. There's some research that indicates the shadows are affected by the phases of the moon. Although the same thing is true about humans. Yeah. Uh. That would explain Yucatan's mood swings. Hey, wasn't it a full moon the night we went to the monorail? It's not a thing you say. By the way, uh, is something wrong? Hey, did you see the moon on the night the dorm was attacked back in April? It was full. Today is June eighth. The monorail incident happened on May 9th. And the assault in the dorm was on April 9th. They were all on a full moon. Yeah. 
Mitsuru, are you there? Uh, Eagle, shut those doors. Hey, can you hear me? Mitsuru, come in. Be careful. Mitsuru, Mitsuru. What is that? It's much bigger than the others, and it's attacking someone. Damn it! Lost here. The big boss is somewhere else. My guess is right. They come every full moon. We've got to hurry. Hey, wait for me. We found a teleporter. Oh, not the bike. There's two of them. Mitsuru! Takeba! <sighs> What's going on? Nothing's working! Sonata-san! Gotta draw the shadows away! Ooh, you Junpei? Yeah, I'm on it. Hey, if it's a fight you want, then you've got it! Akihiko, be Found you too. Normal attacks don't work on them. Hmm? Hey! What the- Huh. Uh, Uka. No, what are you doing here? Moriyama son? Hey, come back! She'll be okay. Please get out of here! It's not safe! I. I had to tell you. I'm sorry. Oh. So bright. Persona. Oh god. Critical hit. Persona? I can see. I I can see these monsters' weaknesses. <laughs> can it be? <laughs> Just as I thought. <laughs> Itsuru, let her take her place. We'll handle these guys. Oh, does that mean we can fight with her? <laughs> <laughs> For the monster's weaknesses. Oh, please give me some time. Hmm, I need to attack with one. No, what's the plan? Say fire. So. It's one physical. Oh shit. Hold on. Whoa. That looks so cool. It's done. I can start the analysis at any time. Alright, charging. Please tell me when to activate it. Thank you, Fuka. Wait, I have to press that for analysis? We'll deplete your SP. Ah. Well, that's going to be done after everyone, both others and enemies have started their turn in the first round. That's overpowered. I didn't know I had this kind of power. That's cool. Your ability is just what we hoped for. Mm. It's even more accurate than Mitsuru's. Yeah. Got him. Yeah. Let's 
Yes, your turn. Let's see. There we go. First all that on My gray. Mm-hmm. Ah, Arky's attack. I'm cheating this. I'm boo-foo. Hold on. Yeah. No, you're not fine, Brian. He's there. That's effective in full moon. Oof. Damn. Thank god he didn't use on me. That's true, all of them, but. Dang. Get that guy down. No. Whoa, I dodged that. <laughs> we got this. <laughs> Sorry, Jinpei. <laughs> it's okay, it's still something. Get Rex. Are there more of them? Nah. Don't worry. It's over. Luca, you are you okay? Yeah. Oh, thank goodness. Oh God. Oh. Right. She's just exhausted. I kind of hurt that. Luca, Luca, I. Where did those two shadows come from? Down the stairs. Outside of Tartarus. Oh. Just like with the dorm and the monorail. Outside, huh? Mm. Uh, what are we going to do about Moriyama-san? She knows about the Dark Hour and the Shadows. It doesn't matter. She's not like us, so she won't remember anything that happens in the Dark Hour. The good news is, she didn't fall victim to the Shadows despite hearing their call. But doesn't that mean she'll forget Yamagishi-san saved her life? Nah. That doesn't seem right. Don't worry. Actually, I get the feeling that things will work out. Mm. I'm sorry, Fuka. She felt so guilt guilt before this. It looks like she's learned her lesson. Yeah. And that is where her character growth begins. I feel way too exhausted. I'm gonna get some wisdom back in the room. Mm. Yeah, Megishi and Moriyama are recovering nicely. They'll be released from the hospital in the next few days. That's good to hear. Yes it is. We'll need to invite in Yamagishi to the dorm and explain what happened. Considering that power of hers, we could definitely use her help. Maybe. Oh, come on right now. Greetings, Rakoto Dona. I humbly request you join me in the fashion club. Uh, oh, yes. Hopeless. Let's go. I cannot focus. 
I have barely sown anything at all. Why not take a break? As a matter of fact, yes, that is a good idea. Mm -hmm. Natajik and I. No problem, I helps should... me. I keep thinking about my uncle. How can I convince him to let me stay here? Maybe if I became a samurai, I could stand up to him. Dang. Oh, maybe if we go have ourselves a sweet snack, I can come up with a plan. Mm -hmm. Will you go to Azuki High with me? Let's do it. Then to Azuki High we go. Mm. Anything, I'll even buy. I have thought about this even in my dreams. About what? I return to my own country now, I would never forgive myself. I want to stay here, in Japan, even if I have to eat dirt. <laughs> Damn. I have you back. Hatajik and I. It means the world knows you are here for me. Jitsuwa. Actually, I have come up with a plan. Wait, I will return to my own country. Huh? What you on? But of course. I will not give up just like that. Once Already? I my uncle, I will return. I will show him that this is a wonderful country. All I need to do is figure out how to explain it to him. Interesting. And with you at my side, I know I will find a way. Please, I can't do it without you. Onegashimasu. It's not a thank you. Six. Four to go. Down. The day is coming to an end. We will pick this up next time. Until we meet again. Oh, welcome back. Richard Senpai and Sanada Senpai went to the hospital to pay me Yamagishi Sana's visit. I wonder if she's alright. Same. Hey, so I bet Richard Senpai and Sanada are trying to convince Yamagishi san to join our team. That worries me. There we go. I think they could have sped the um, rank ups a little bit quicker. Hey, so... I was thinking, do you think Kurichi Senpai saved Yamagishi san because it was the right thing to do? Or was it because she's a persona user and we need her? She has good intentions. You're right. Well, I guess it's really up to Yamagishi san whether or not she joins us. Sorry to bring this up out of the bay. No problem. Listen well. Okay. I have come up with a great idea to get my uncle to appreciate Japan's charm. I will show him a kimono. When mm -hmm. he sees it, uh, he will understand the beauty of Nihon. Kimono! That's a great idea. Wait, with you in my corner, I have nothing to fear. Aww. The kimono is so cute. A treasure. Full of culture and history. If I show it to my uncle, he will surely let me stay in Nihon. Oh. As for the design, it yeah. will be inspired by the mascot of Azuki Ai. Simple but deep. I choose this design because, well, yeah, you are the one who took me there. Ah, but he seems to trust me. I thought we were getting closer. See everything clearly now. I shall hurry in Mexico Mono. Yeah. I must so <laughs> like the wind. I believe in you. Some Aki. Yamagishi is being released from the hospital today. We all need to talk to her together. Come to the command room once you get back to the dorm. Ooh. You got that text? Oh, thank goodness! Yeah, gotcha, son. Yamagishi there. He's sleeping in the hospital soon. Isn't that great? Yeah. Aww. I thought, yeah, I didn't need to do that, lol. Whoops. No sign of him. Oh yes, she has the same ringtone. Hey, I just got a text from Kaz. It's for you, but he wanted you to know ASAP, so he texted me too. Okay. It says, come to Iwatodai Station. 
What is that guy thinking? He's get practice today too. For a good reason. Oh, where's the fire? Um, are you okay? Go was pissed, wasn't she? Mm. I've missed a lot of practice lately. It's okay. I should have told you last time, but um, my oh yeah, results, I forgot about that. Muscles and tendons around my knee are inflamed. The Ooh. doctor said if I keep pushing it, that I won't be able to walk anymore. He said I strained it too hard during practice. It's so freaking stupid. I want to win, so I have to practice. Uh, show some guns on this. Other you can do. I'm gonna try this. That's not an excuse. Ooh. Every minute, every second counts. I can't waste any more time. I promised I'd win at next year's meet and become the number one athlete in Japan. You promised? Yeah. I made a promise. Uh -huh. My nephew got into an accident and his legs got messed up. And now, he can't walk. But if he goes through rehab, he might be able to recover. Yeah. He says the rehab hurts too much though, so he doesn't want to do it. Oh. He's only five, you know? There's still so much he hasn't done yet. Mm, that's so, I need to deal with my nephew. Just, uh, don't laugh, okay? If I become number one in Japan, he'll agree to go through rehab. Aww. That's why I have to win this meet, so I can make it to nationals. Hmm. I'll choose this. Do you think he could win? To tell you the truth, I don't think I can do it. Aww. Sorry for all the trouble I've caused. And for all the depressing conversations, it's, all right. it's really tough keeping it all bottled up. You were the only one I could talk to. At least this don't make me sad. This song. How oh, dare it! it just appear out of nowhere. Yuko has good instincts when it comes to this stuff, <laughs> so she might say something to you. Uh, Tell her to come talk to me if she does. Okay. I don't want to drag you into this any deeper. That's nice of you. So, you're Fukuyama Gishiku. Oh, she. Right? Look who's here. Y yes. Yeah. <laughs> Relax, there's no need to be nervous. Go on and have a seat. Uh, okay. I heard that all three girls have regained consciousness. Awesome. That's great news. From what I understand, they each came to the school around midnight and waited for the security guard to leave. Mm. Then, once the dark hour began, they were attacked by shadows near the gate. Because of the situation's similarities to an old ghost story, rumors naturally spread quickly. Yeah. I knew right from the beginning that it wasn't a ghost. <laughs> it's all my fault. What? Where'd you get that from? You were yeah. the victim in all this. You saved our lives. That's not something just anyone could have done. Take pride in that. You have a special power that you can use to help others. A special power? We call it Persona. And right now, our group absolutely needs your abilities. Can we count on you to help us? Are you asking me to join you? If you don't, it's fine. Kirito Senpai. Yeah. I'm glad they give you these options. I think it'd make a good addition to the team too. You know we're not trying to pressure you. So if you need some time to think about it. Yeah. I'll do it. It would be my honor. Aww. What? Are you sure? If you do join, you'll have to move into the dorm. That's fine. I'd rather live here than at home anyway. Aww. Thank you. We really appreciate this. Oh, okay. we'll have the school talk to your parents to resolve any issues. Okay. Thank you. Wait a minute. Aren't we dragging her into this a bit fast? Um, it's okay. Really. And now we have Fuka acquired. I don't see her. Dude, she's the exact opposite of Yukatan. Smart, kind, and modest. Hey, Makoto, what do you think of her? Uh, that's all you think about? Wait, you need to lighten up. Well, fine then. Kuichu, Kun, and Sonata left to walk. Yamagishi, oh, that's when they are. It's late after all. That's cute. Still, today was a great day for us all. We've gained a new power and learned more about the shadows. We're entering the next phase of our battle. 
we can't just sit on our hands either. I'd say we could use a new trick up, up our sleeves. <sighs> I know she technically made the decision on her own, but it didn't seem like Yamagishi-san was really given much of a choice to me. I don't like this. I know. Whoop. Oh, now yeah, Karenitas is sold out. Maybe I'll try something even if it's... Buy more drinks at the vending machine in front of the retired station. Nice. Oh, that's SP. That helped me out last time. One minute, let's go. It's one more for that one. Good morning. Good morning. Hey, Yuki kun, what do you think of Yamagishi san? I'll say she's helpful. She's also adorable there. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah. I mean, yeah, her persona ability is pretty amazing, but doesn't it seem like she wasn't really given a choice to join the team? I hope she'll be okay. Huh? Hey, did you hear? What? Apparently, Mr. Okoda's in hot water. Oh, that's what this is about? Um, good morning. Oh, she back. Hey, look! It's the ghost girl! Rude. Quiet, she can hear you. Oh, Fuka, you're here. Yeah, how about Where welcome at back? I heard you started living in the dorms. Oh. Yes. That was quick. You're looking glum today, as usual. Well, if you got something on your mind, you can always talk to me. You could probably use a friend. Huh. Mm -hmm. Mariyama san. Mm -hmm. Come on, you don't gotta be so stiff. Just call me Natsuki. <gasps> Thank you. And there goes a beautiful friendship. Hi, baby. I messed away with the kimono. I have need you for your strength. Kata Kane. I am great internally grateful then today I shall sew I've never sewed before. Sewing is my life. Mm. My wallet may be light, and my materials may be cheap. But Such I passion. To make a beautiful kimono and save my future. I begin a new one. How's it going? Mm. This is starting to come together. Manzoku. When my uncle sees this, I know he'll agree with me about how great Nihon is. When will it be done? It's far from being finished. Uh. So I must work even harder. I made so much progress today. And I could not have done it without your help. Uh. Merci. Arigato. Thank you. Mm. Almost done. Oh, my arms are so very tired. I must have overworked them, but no matter mm. what's the cost, I will finish this kimono. Uh, take a break if you have to. Nihon, I cannot give up now. What's up, dude? Oh yeah, I hear Fuka's moving into one of the rooms on a third floor. Well, the girls put their foot down when I offered to help, said you guys aren't allowed. Anyway, it looks like she'll be coming here pretty early tomorrow. Exciting stuff, huh? Yay! What is it? If you're looking for Mitsuru and Takiba, they're on the third floor. Sounds like they're getting Yamagishi's room ready. So I doubt it would be much use. Unless, like, they find a cockroach or something. Damn. Morning. <sighs> Good morning, Yuki. Yamagishi will be living in a dorm with us starting today. And from this point on, she'll be providing us with support in Tartarus at night. That means I can start joining battles again. Oh, yeah. Yes, you can depend on me. Even if I'm a bit slow starting out, rest assured I'll, that I'll catch up to you all in no time. I've seen one of her um, crits and she looks so freaking queen. Oh, we're all hanging out. Oh, good. You're all here. Yeah. I know this is sudden, but the chairman will be coming by again this evening. I'd like everyone to gather at the usual place tonight. Yeah. He just came by the other day. Something happened. Luca? Apparently, he's prepared some special gifts for us. Oh. I know it'll be busy with Yamagishi moving into the dorm, but I'd appreciate it if you could all come by. Hmm. What gift, though? Special? 
Does that mean we can expect something good? Like sushi? This is Ikutsuki san we're talking about. He's True. probably just gonna tell us some new joke he made up. <laughs> he doesn't ever say it when we're around. You can. Oh, I did. Wow, well, she hasn't spoken once. Let's go. Okay, shopping for club stuff is done. Good thing you came with me. I didn't realize there was so much to buy. Also, I wasn't really in the mental state to do this alone today. Aww. What happened? Oh, nothing major. Maybe I was exaggerating a bit. Hmm. Still bothering me, though. In today's classic literature pop quiz, I didn't know any of the answers. And oh. before I knew it, I dozed off. I ended up handing him <laughs> a blank paper. Oof. I've been there. That's right. It was your fault. I know, right? I didn't do it on purpose. But then Mr. Okoda oh, that... pissed off. He called me to the faculty office and told me I had to write a reflection essay. Damn, he sucks. I had to listen to Mr. Okoda lecture me for the longest time. He was all like, uh, this rate you'll end up as a good for nothing adult. And you're not putting enough thought into your future. Come on, <laughs> it's way too early to worry about the future, isn't it? We're still just teenagers. Yeah. Don't worry about that too much. Right? We should be allowed to enjoy ourselves now while we still can. Honestly, I yes, haven't really do that. thought about my future at all. I'm working hard for the track team, so I think that's good enough for now. As for the future, exactly. Well, <laughs> I've got plenty of time to think about it later. Boy, did I not know what I was gonna do. Hmm, I guess this isn't the best place for a long conversation. Huh. I'm gonna go drop these off at the storage room. See ya! Aww. Oh god. Wow. <laughs> that was so clumsy, fool. Oh, I have to tell you, you can call me Big Sis, nothing else. Auntie. Oh no, they're gonna catch me. See ya, Andy. <laughs> hey, wait. And he's gone. That kid lives across the street from me. Uh. Why on earth are they playing tag in a place like this? I mean, it's dangerous, right? You should go play in the schoolyard or something. Oh no, the school gate is gonna close soon. Uh, I'll see you at practice. Bye. Oh, she's here. -san. So Are cute. You in there? Yes, come in. Exactly the same way as the dancing game. I think we should start heading to the command room and... Huh? You already finished unpacking? I was planning on helping you out later, too. Well, I didn't have too much with me, so I finished a lot sooner than I expected. Oh, the plans. Oh, are you good with computers by any chance? You think you could teach me? I'm really not good with stuff like that. Sure, mm. if you'd like me to. Aww. Are you looking into something? Yes. I figured I should know everyone's defining characteristics and whatnot to prepare for battle. I can't do any actual fighting, so I need to make myself useful. Oh, I see. You're a really hard worker, Yamagishi-san. Yeah. And you've got an amazing ability, too. Now that I think about it, everyone in this dorm is pretty amazing, huh? Sonata-senpai is hands down one of the strongest. Yeah. And our leader has be? power unlike anyone else's. I bet Kirijo-senpai is strong, too. And Junpei... Well, he's... A crit god. But what do I have? I'm only half the person everyone else here is. I couldn't even do anything the last few Well, moon. you don't miss. Maybe I don't need to be here after all. <laughs> That's not true at all. Aww. Huh? I was told that a persona is the power of the soul, also known as your other self. Ooh. That's why I think a person's personality and feelings are reflected in their persona. I mean, they talk about this uh, now. For example, Takeba-san, your persona has healing powers, right? That's because there's a kindness in you that no one oh. else has. That's so sweet. Uh, I'm not kind at all. 
I just don't want to yeah. see anyone go down or get hurt, that's all. Hey, it's that definition of kindness. Come on. I think akutsuki sounds gonna be here soon. Oh, and you can just call me Yukari. I hope you like it here, Fuka. I'm sure I will. Thank you, Yukari-chan. Yukari. Sorry for calling you all again so soon. I don't think that concept was in the today. game. Well, let me just show you before oh, I get into Paul's explaining now. what it is. A gift? I'd like to provide you with some new equipment. New equipment? After spending quite some time in development, we're now ready for the battle testing Oh, phase. we went from bands to these now. The shadows are getting stronger. I was wondering about that. You just barely won the last battle. We can only assume they'll grow even more powerful still. That's why you all need something more to stay in the fight. Combat gear, complete with a matching armband. And, and your new trump card in the battle against the shadows. The thirty charges that enable the use of theurgy. This is new. Theurgy means spiritual oh. magic that could reach the gods in Greek. To put it simply, Ooh. it synchronizes with the user's emotions, and when the right nice use of are right, Greek mythology allows them to unleash an attack of immense power. Oh, you're talking about signature attacks! Oh yeah! I've been waiting for something like this! Okay. Hey, that's not key sign. Well, about that. Mm. It's a bit difficult to explain. I think it might be easier if you just try it out for yourself. Now? Alright. It's random. Hold on. Isn't it dangerous to use something like this without knowing how it works? Not really. Oh, don't worry about that. It's been well tested and determined completely safe. Interesting. Okay, I'm leaving the rest to you, Kirijo Kun. Oh boy! And there he goes. <laughs> I sort of thought this before, but he's rather laid back, isn't he? Yeah. <laughs> More like careless. I was just excited. Oh, this is the music. So this is where it all comes together. Mm. New gloves. You need to just send us a new fit. Um. Can Makoto walk? Rip. Oh man, this is mm. awesome! We're like a super elite task force. Yeah, professional looking now. Come on, could you at least wear it mm. like you're supposed to? Yeah, I love it. Each one is made to with that outfit, what they're wearing. They were testing the prototype out on me, but it feels even better than it did before. It's mm. very light and sturdy. I wonder if it's the same materials they use in the military, or maybe even the ones for spacesuits. Seems like this armband isn't just for decoration either. Hmm. According to the manual, there are a bunch of different features built into it. Any armband? For example, it can give you a readout of your vitals. Hmm. What else? There's also a function that notifies you when you can use your theurgy? Eh, uh, what does that do? Sorry, it doesn't look like there's much information about that. All yeah. I can tell is that you load the cartridge into your evoker to use it. Oh. Then let's make that our objective for today. This time, I'll be joining the rest of you in battle. Yay! I'm going too. I gotta make sure my skills are still sharp. Me too! Hey, Falk can go oh, only. Then including our leader, that will be our team. Hey, I... Wait, I wanna go too! I'm I wanna... so ready for this! You can't just put me on standby. We can't go without our leader. You stay here and support Yamagishi. Gonna keep my ace in reserve. I was honestly wanting Junpei and Log, but okay. Oh, really? <laughs> when you put it that way, how can I refuse? Don't worry, Fuka. Nothing's getting past me. 
okay. Oh yeah, you better behave soon. This is so cool how new this is. Different in here from before. Hmm. Well, that's nothing new, right? What do you mean, you fucker? No, not like that. Huh? It seems distorted. It's probably just temporary. I'll try and find a stable floor for us to start on. Okay. You can tell that much already? Wow, Fuka. All right. Okay. Let's go. Look at Mitsuru though. I thought he cuffed us all the um school oh, uniform. That new sword looks pretty cool. In mind. Thanks. And this bow I got is really light and looks pretty easy to use. I can't wait to see it in action. So the chairman got us all new weapons too, huh? Guess wait, I do have a new. He barely explained anything though. Sometimes I can't tell if he's actually helpful mm. or not. All of this has been custom made for us. You can tell because of the C's mark engraved on everything. This is so weird how the, now it's voice acted. I was gonna skip it. As always, you're in command. And make sure to check the equipment before we get started. Yeah, that's true. Whoa, look at that. C's everything. Oh, wait, I'm, that is no equipment, that is. Oh. Oh, it's not today. Everyone's wearing C's things. It's all you do. I'll hold things down here, so give them a hell. Here, Chi, was it? I'm looking forward to seeing how it works. That aside, let's handle this like we always do. It's Masuru's first real battle in a while, too. Hmm. Oh, by the way, do you know what those numbers on our new armbands mean? If it's the order that we join C's, wouldn't, shouldn't yours and mine be your first? Maybe it's kind of random. I mean, there's no number two. Mm, I don't know. <laughs> I could finally fight at your side now. On top of that, we have new battle gear and equipment. Hopefully you'll find me reliable. When I'm geared up, just like everyone else, it really gets me psyched up. Yeah. Everyone looks so cool. You ready? Yeah. I'll try to guide you to a more stable floor. I can't go with you, but I'll do my best to back you up, Amir. We did reach the top like soon. Oh, that was quick. Yamagishi, do you copy? Yes, I'm here. <laughs> Hi, Fuka. Any shadows? Um, it looks like there's one close by. Be careful. All right, let's head over there and feel things out. <laughs> My God, look at everyone. Oh, look at her. No, we have to be fair. Oh, it's that one. I'm far more in my element. Whoa. Let me show you that I haven't lost my She's touch. ready. Mmm, that can't through there. Such a queen. So when do we slouch you then? And how? Oh, they're weak. Ow. It still doesn't say combos. I can take over any time. I'll take it from here. I'll hit them where it hurts. All right, that about let's move on. No shadows detected. Mm. Looks like everything went well. Fuka, you were amazing. Great job. <laughs> Thank you, Yukari chan. Still send some enemies nearby. Keep an eye out if you decide to engage them. Okay. Oh, we're engaging them. <laughs> <laughs> amazing. Time for an all-out attack. 
Level up. Nice. Turn the defense down. Oh, it's just accuracy again. Dang. I really need that one. Okunda. One of my uniform seems to be working out, but about that thorough the Yorichi thing. Yamagishi, have you figured anything out on your end? I'm sorry, it's still unclear. I'm picking something up during battle though. Oh. It's no pressure, just continue observation. What? I'm sensing something on the floor above us. Something strange. A good strange or bad? Kind of powerful shadow. Oh, okay. No, it's it feels similar to the distortion I felt earlier. Mm. Roger, let's move carefully and assess the situation when we get upstairs. Where? Uh what? It's dark. You were all sent to different locations on this floor. Okay. We got separated? So they separated us by force. There's danger lurking in this darkness. We need to regroup as soon as possible. Yamagishi. I like he still sense shadows. Can you like yell something? Oh, you can't really. uh, Why now? Fuka, where should I go if I want to... <sighs> One to one. Look out! Huh? What? What the heck? Shut up! <sighs> oh, Yukari, I'm here. What the heck? You know this one? Oh, no, that is a strong one. What's that doing here? Not again. Oh, it's okay. Oh my god, I'm dizzy. Me I'm getting hurt because of it. Oh, that loin! Oh, that hurts. What am I even doing? Oh, good, we just got bad timing. I think Gara is its weakness, but still, it's got big defense. Okay. No, you scar it. Oh, free it. Oh my God, you carry. Oh, the center sheets full. I know. Now's the time. How did they get full now? Well, when emotions run high in battle, you and your party members will be able to activate Theochi. It can be activated on your turn when your Theochi gauge is maxed. Unlike normal skills, they do not cost HP or SP. Please note that it cannot be used while you are inflicted by status ailment. Hmm. Is it like a cutscene? After healing someone, her desire to prevent death strengthens. Mm. Your chi. Whoa. She uses more arms. That's like the strongest scouting move. Are you okay? Damn. I'm sorry, it was all my fault. Oh, I see you're okay. Thanks. But you shouldn't be so reckless. Mm. Takeba, leader. Looks like you both are okay. Thanks to you, Kari. Sorry, I worried everyone. It's all right. You did well in handling an unexpected mm. situation. Maybe we should consider starting over. Let's head back to the entrance for now. Sounds good. Good work out there, team. Thanks. I'm sorry. 
I should have been able to navigate better. You did great for your first time. I agree. I'm convinced that you're the one we need on support. Yeah, thanks a lot, Fuka. Rain Tartarus. I didn't do anything. It was all you, Yukari chan. Yeah, it really was. That special attack sure was cool though, Yukatan. How'd you do it? Hmm. How? I just focused really hard and thought to myself, I have to do whatever it uh, takes. <laughs> and while I was thinking that, I kind of felt something surging inside me. The chairman did say the cartridge would synchronize with our emotions. I didn't. Still not entirely sure how it works. Same figure. From what I could tell, it reacted to Yukari chan's strong emotions. I guess, like, whenever a damage happens, like, it goes up. So this weapon gives the user strength beyond their limits when their emotions are heightened? Uh, I don't really get it. But basically, if we're fired up enough, <laughs> we can really pop off, right? I hope so. And thanks to you, Yukari-chan, we have a good idea of how it works. Yeah. From now on, I should be able to tell when someone can use theirs. That's good. Although I can see it. It's all thanks to you. I, I didn't do much. In any case, we may have had some problems, but we learned a lot today. Aw, Kirijo Senpai! <laughs> Quit buttering me up. Just leave everything to Junpei Iori, yeah. the soon to be MVP. Aw. Next time, Maybe though. I shouldn't be the one to say this, but you literally mm -hmm. didn't do anything today. We know this, but we don't talk about that. Oh, that large key use it now. No, it's not here again. I've been chatting with a mother lately uh, today, and boy, he's really mature. He definitely acts a lot more adult than Chunpei. I might just warn us all. Wait, you two? Come on, man, that's messed up getting up on me, Yona. I just hang with him, I guess. I'm sorry for dumping some real heavy stuff on you the last time, but you think it could help me out again? I'm going to my sister's place today and I want to get something for my nephew. I'm pretty bad at picking up presents and stuff, so I figured I'd ask you for a second. I know. A video game. That makes sense, that way he won't be bored at home. But games could be pretty expensive. This is for my nephew, anything for my nephew. And uh, if I don't have enough money, you can mind spotting me? <laughs> Fuka! Once again, I'll be substituting for Kirichu Senpai as your navigator from now on. Please let me know if you want to go to Tartarus, and I'll do my best. Yamagishi couldn't surprise me skill with technology. She's very kind, always considering others' feelings. Her name suits her perfectly. Meet Fu meets Wind, and Car meets Flower. Oh, that's why. Like a flower gently blowing in the wind? Yeah, going off track. I'm sure you're already feeling it, but the enemies are steadily growing more powerful. Don't be satisfied with how you are now. Work on improving your strength if you wait until after a tough battle will be too late. Oh, dude, I almost got in trouble with the police today. What? I was damn lucky. It was just a false alarm? What is Shunpei doing? I guess all that talk about Fuka being sick wasn't true. At first, people were saying that she was absent because she was being bullied, but then started saying she was really sick. Yeah. Strange, huh? She seems pretty healthy to me. I mean, must have looked bad at the moment. Well, that's an eventful week. All right, <sighs> I'm gonna keep the Our language could be awfully complex. Don't you hate when you know the meaning of a word, but you can't remember the word, word itself? Yep. This feels like a good time for a spontaneous question. You, I don't like that. Let's see, Chunpei shifting in his seat a bit too much. So instead, how about you, Yukikun? Which phrase means able to see things for what they really are? Keen eye? Yep, exactly. Yay. You may very well have been a key eye yourself. Having a keen eye means you're able to see things for what they really are. It can also help you make a good decision for the future. 
That goes for the rest of you too. You need to learn how to look past the surface, otherwise you'll grow up superficial. That's a little much. Oh my god, the Rees? 